Yeah, come in. Hi, man. Good morning. Church! Beautiful, Adra. Oh, Lord, this guy will not kill somebody in this office. See that person calm down, fire scatter. Hey! Adra, see, do you know that? God created you on a public holiday. Really? In fact, He used the finest materials to create you. <laughs> see, see, look at your smile. See, anytime you smile like this, you turn me on. Turn me on? Ah, you turn me on, turn me off, then turn me on again. <laughs> Other beautiful ladies are supposed to be studying you in school as a course. Beautiful at your 101. <laughs> because we are their mentor. Hey, no, no. <laughs> oh, Forget about the lies. You see, Adio. I've been asking you out for how long? Eh? When are you going to accept me? Mm. You want to make a kick out before you go accept me? <laughs> eh? Come on, Nana. You know office romance is not healthy for work. Ah, ah. Who says I am going to romance you at the office? Eh? That is why my bed is at home. Who do the romance there? Really? Yes. I just bought a new bed. Come and help me and baptize it. Oh, boy. <laughs> Nobody has laid on that bed. Mm. I want you to be the first and the last on the bed. And I have a lot of things to do. You just came and you are yes. You are going. I have a bright future for me. Think about my life. I'm not promising you anything. Yeah. Are you having Shake! Oh, shake it! Is. Oh Lord! Shake and confuse my destiny. Oh, oh. Good morning, sir. Morning. Get me the liberty for. Yes, please. Position your bonbon -bon towards me this morning. It's like you intentionally did that to tempt me. No, <laughs> no. Mm. If that's your plan, then congratulations. You have succeeded in tempting me. I have fallen. Okay, so um, I'm about leaving. Leave? You want to lose your job? <laughs> you want to lose your destiny? No, I can't afford to lose my job now. Good. So do what you have to do to keep your job. Please stop. Stop saying please and please me. I'm your boss for God's sake. You will like it. You will enjoy it. I'll take good care of you. Thank you. I have to leave. Look, stop acting like a child. Hey, hey, my child. Look, girl, hey. 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 <laughs> Hey, come down here, child. <laughs> hmm. I'm going to scream if you touch me. I oh, swear. I want you to scream when I put it in. Do you want it the corporate way or the hard way? <laughs> Come, 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 come
come to my office. Come, let's come talk to me. What happened? You know I can't stand the sight of seeing you cry. Talk to me, please. <laughs> Raped? Who? How? Where? Who raped you, Ajwa? Oh my god. Ajwa, talk to me, please. I can't tell you. I'm going to lose my job. We're talking about your life here. You're talking about your job. You can always get another job, Ajwa. Talk to me. Who raped you? Who did this to you? Oh my goodness. Ajwa, do you know that if you don't speak out, there are so many things that can go wrong? What if, what if the person is HIV positive? Do you know he can infect you with it? But if you speak now, the disease can be removed from your body, give, give him the right medication within 72 hours. Have you even thought about pregnancy, Ajwa? Ajwa, talk to me. Open up. Your psychological state is even very important here. If you speak up early, we can take you to a psychologist and you'll, you'll be fine. Ajwa, what happened to you? Who, who, who did this to you? Mr. Michael. <laughs> which, which of them, Mr. Michael? Our boss? <laughs> Our boss raped you. Oh, God. See, stop crying. We need to go report to the police immediately. Let's go report to the police station. Please, please stand up. From the police, we'll go to the hospital so that we can take a sperm sample so we can, we can get him. Are you Mr. Michael? Yes, I am Mr. Michael. I am Detective Sam. And with me is? Inspector James. So, how uh, may I help you, please? We are from the Nima Police Headquarters. You're under arrest for the alleged rape of Miss Ajua Bright. And remember, anything you say or do as of this moment will be used against you in the court of law. Ajua said I raped her. <laughs> why, 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 why would I do that? Why would I do that? Sir, we're taking you this way in peace because of your man of status. So please kindly follow us to the station. No problem. No problem. This is what we'll do, eh? Uh, you go to the station, I'll call my lawyer, we'll come to the station, and uh, we'll, we'll, we'll try this out, okay? Mr. Michael, all that will be provided for you at the station. Thank you. No, 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 you don't, you don't have to, you don't have to, you know? No, you don't have to, like... <laughs> yes, I mix up somewhere. I do said I rape Why would I rape a do for what? A man of my caliber. A, a man of my caliber. I'm a married man. Very responsible. You understand? So I don't know why Adwa will, will fabricate such a story. Don't, don't touch me. I will move. Okay. But you know something? Look, we can even settle this. This is not even an issue that we are supposed to, you know, go to the station or anything. Obviously, I don't understand. It's, it's just this is a, a, a very small you know, family issue. I'm a man of public status. You get it? We can settle this at Amica without even going to the station or whatever. Because all these girls, you know how they can behave. No, calm down. Calm down, you understand? I'm a man of, you know, <laughs> let's sort this out. I'll sort you. 